education is the rising tide that lifts all ships. And if we're not going to hold those in charge of executing our state budget, our federal budget, in supporting our schools, who we must hold accountable, if we refuse to hold ourselves accountable, then how are we ever going to climb up and rise up the ranks and, and serve our people in the way that their taxpayer dollars demand? Just own it. The easiest thing to do is own it. You made a mistake. You didn't handle the money right. State representatives Melissa Provenzano and Mark McBride, a Democrat and Republican, say people need to be held responsible for millions in federal funding that was misspent. We told you a multi-county grand jury report showed $18 million meant for students and families in need during the pandemic was misspent. The grand jury made several recommendations to prevent future misspending, including mandatory federal grant management training for agencies getting more than 10 million federal dollars a year, requiring agencies to have written rules and policies on federal grant management, and establishing a state training program on conflicts of interest, record keeping, and preventing fraud and mismanagement. I think there needs to be a vetting process. Both lawmakers believe the lack of accountability started at the top with Governor Kevin Stitt. The grand jury report claims the problems could have been avoided if the State Department of Education had been allowed to manage the money instead of outside organizations. We got to do better. I do say that the people that got the money and misspent it, now they were wrong because they knew what the money was for too. You know, I, I do think they were wrong. They've got to take some blame here. Yeah, doing better is the starting point. So what do we do? Honestly, this <laughs> that's a good question. Right? It's time for action by our leaders. I'm concerned that the inaction is blessing this behavior. And so it's time for the people to say, do something.